Hello everybody, it's Boaz Fowler in Georgia. We're here with the Daily Astrology Forecast for August 25th, 2016. So the conjunction between Mars and Saturn is over its peak. It's still stressful today, but we're over the peak, thank God. <laughs> and <clears throat> today the sky is full of hard aspects. This is a hard day. This is a day that we should really be careful not to go too much into our own doom and gloom and uh, understand we could be extra moody today and we could go into conflicts and uh, confrontations with no real reason we just have a very short fuse this, the moon is in i'm sorry the moon is in gemini it's squaring the sun already the masculine and feminine parts within us are in imbalance and that could prove to be imbalance as well regarding um, uh, males and females in our lives and then there's an opposition to Mars Saturn between the moon and Mars Saturn creating a t-square a little later on with Neptune so a lot of hard aspects in the sky then the moon uh, squares the nodes at the nighttime and if you are in the United States there's the Queen Conx to Pluto at around 20 hundred hours Eastern Standard Time and if you are in Europe you'll be sleeping by then hopefully because it's like 3 a.m. so this day is full of hard aspects in the sky. We could really get hurt easily. We could lash out on people. So just be very careful with the way you react and put everything in proportions. Let the river be the river. You'll be the samurai sword in the river. Cut that water and let it pass you. Don't actually get involved with it. Venus, uh, that's... Uh, Opposing Chiron and Queen Kong Uranus, we talked about it yesterday, sensitive time in relationships, but Jupiter, the great benefactor, comes to our aid, and as, as Venus grows, com comes near Jupiter and, and conjuncts Jupiter, we'll be getting more optimism, benevolence, and confidence, and just a plentiful feeling within our relationships, within our life in general, harmony is heightened, and our moods are getting better and we could actually benefit from it in our relationships or with everything that concerns satis satisfaction from life and monetary value we could earn more money we could get money more easily and we can enjoy life in general more than we do when venus and and uh, Jupiter are conjunct but we can also really want rich foods and eat more than we used we usually do or spend more money on pleasures but uh, sensory pleasures or materialistic pleasures than we usually do so we really have to watch what we spend our money on and we have to watch our weight so that's everything for today thank you for listening on behalf of Georgia and myself May you have a very pleasant day. Bye-bye.